Yo, what's up traders? Welcome to a new video and in this video I will go over how to never lose a trade again. How to never lose a trade again, at least not immediately. And what do I mean by that? I mean, you will not lose a trade anymore if the market makes a fake out. So what do I mean by a fake out? A fake out is something like this. So over here we see that the market goes up it goes down and then over here we like well uh, I see a supply zone this is a resistance level uh, so there's yeah it's likely that it would go down over here we have a high level then another high level and then probably we would go downwards again over here when we see some bearish momentum uh, so let's say that you take a sell order and then the price goes to the upside and then it goes to the downside so when you see these candles and you were like well the price should go down it has to go down it has to drop uh, i see a resistance supply zone you take a sell order all right it goes a little bit to the downside but then it goes to the upside and your stop loss is placed over here and then you got faked out right because it goes to the upside uh, all the liquidity over here got caught and then finally it drops to the downside exactly like you expected so a lot of people they can trade they know yeah what the trend is where the price should go but in the meantime they they just lose trades because of this typical fake out moves these typical fake out moves um, so this is yeah I've been working on this for the for nine to ten months right now for, yeah, just working on automated trading what do I mean by that just yeah experimenting with Forex robots I hired developers high-level developers in order to yeah just create what I have in my mind and basically in a mt4 robot so that was for the last nine to ten months i've been working really really hard and i came to the conclusion that a hundred percent a fully automated robot a hundred percent fully automated robot is quite hard to develop uh, then uh, i'm even not sure if that is possible to be honest uh, if i look at yeah, big hedge funds big investment funds they also do not have robots that work a hundred percent on uh yeah autopilot they always have people that manage these robots and just help these robots to trade profitably uh, and just prevent that these robots blow so uh yeah when i discovered that i was like well maybe i should just follow the banks and the investment funds and yeah all these big institutions that trade billions and billions of dollars every single day i discovered that i should become a hybrid trader myself as well what i developed is a hybrid system what the strategy is is that i take a sell order and uh, yeah it was the first trade i experimented a little bit with the strategy and i was like well uh, first I want to take a trade myself and yeah I do all the all the technical analysis like uh, support resistance uh, trend uh, supply demand zone and all that um, and then when I think well this is a nice a nice level a key level I see bullish momentum bearish momentum whatever then I take the trade myself first uh, let's say 50 pips TP and 50 pips stop loss so quite simple one-on-one -on -one risk reward rates your trade and um, yeah and I risk 1% so if I lose 50 pips then I lose 1% of my account if the target gets hit and the 50 pips TP gets hit then I will gain 1% so I was like well uh, in the last few months I have developed a system that uh, yeah should help me in order to trade profitably and I won't lose any trades anymore because of these fake outs I'm just fed up with these fake outs I 
uh, they're really annoying so I was like maybe I should just combine my knowledge my trading knowledge with a robot and if you do that correctly then you basically are a hybrid trader and I tested it out and I'm quite surprised because it worked exactly how I would like it to work uh, yeah just as expected basically and uh, my first trade was over here and I took this one on purpose because I wanted to test uh, yeah to just let the EA let the robot do its thing and of course I was also in the position because I saw this move I was also in the position to take a sell order over here but then uh, yeah I I would hit my target and uh, yeah then the EA didn't work because the good thing about this is that the EA the robot doesn't work doesn't uh, place any orders if my initial trade hits TP right it only works when my virtual stop loss gets hit so for example over here I place my stop loss over here because this is the highest point and then um, as you can see I took a sell order it went profit for a few hours and then it went to the upside and over here my yeah virtual stop loss got hit and instead of just taking a loss my robot takes another sell order and then finally it the price goes to the yeah keeps going to the upside and then my robot takes another sell order and then it keeps going up and then my robot takes another sell order and then finally it closes all the four orders over here at this spot with one percent profit because like i said uh, i am trading one on one risk reward and i would like to gain one percent and i'm I'm risking 1% so uh, yeah this is exactly what I wanted and as you can see my um, you can't see it you know, my, over here this is my my first order uh, this is a cat JPY 0 0.15 lot size and the second order was uh, so this was placed by the robot 0 0.15 again and then the third one was 0 0.16 and the uh, fourth one was 0 0.18 so i'm working with a martingale with a small martingale system and i think that if you're working with a martingale system that uh, yeah doesn't use exponentially uh, yeah bigger lot sizes like uh, 0 0.30 and then 0 0.60 and then 1.20 right uh, then it's it's i won't say safe but there's a smaller chance that it would blow your account quite easily, right? That's why all the trades get closed over here at this point, right? And not over here, or maybe it wasn't even able to close uh, all the trades. And that is just because of the small martingale over here. And as you can see, uh, yeah, it was a nice move, uh, almost 1%, and this was yeah because of the swap so yeah this is my system that i'm going to keep testing and uh, yeah i will leave a link down in the description with uh, my fix book so you can just follow my journey and uh, yeah, i will just test it out for maybe a few months and then see how it performed uh, hopefully it performs quite well and uh, yeah if there's always a possibility that it doesn't work out but like I said, these fake outs, they happen just too often. And we don't, we don't take any losses anymore because of these stupid fake outs, right? Yes, of course, there's always a risk that it would blow your account. The only scenario that I can think of is that my manually placed trade is that bad that I, let's say, I place a sell order on a, a weekly support level in a weekly demand zone for example and it just keeps going up 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 and uh, we all also have something like a new coronavirus or uh, another big event in the world that drives the, the the price up and it keeps going to the upside and then of course of course then yeah you have a big problem but i always have a virtual equity drawdown 
number in my head which is about 10 percent that means that if my equity goes above the 10 percent drawdown then uh, yeah i of course look at the market and i wait a little bit for it to just pivot uh, if that doesn't happen then i need to close out all the trades so it's like a mental stop loss uh, when it reaches 10 percent i really need to make sure that i don't blow this account and uh yeah just protect my money of course because that is rule number one protect your money protect your capital and rule number two is make more money um so yeah that is basically uh what i'm going to not really focus on the coming few months but i yeah i will keep testing this strategy and benefit of trading this way is that i don't have to keep looking at the charts anymore and uh, and i also don't need to be afraid of getting stopped out unnecessary uh wow yeah later on i see that the price really goes into my direction right so um yeah i don't use the stop loss on the first one but i do use a hard mental stop loss of about 10 percent 10 percent of my uh, of my equity so um yeah uh, that is basically it uh like i said i will share the maya fix book link in the description so you guys can uh, yeah just follow my journey as well and then in yeah maybe i will i will drop an update every single week maybe once in two weeks maybe even once a month uh, about uh, the progress and if the strategy uh, does work like i uh, like i hope that it would work so uh yeah if you like this video give this video a thumbs up subscribe and i see you in the next one